my day in the life in the middle of the week, which means it's gonna be more like a half day in the life because <laughs> I have to work. Um, well, I've been working. So we are about, we are over halfway through my work day. Ooh, I wasn't even on my face. Um, I was looking at the clock. So I have about two and a half hours left of work, a little over, and I have a work meeting and then stuff to do. And then I'm thinking I wanna go get a pedicure and I definitely wanna go to the gym today. And I also wanna go to Ulta. So, wow, it got dark. Anyway, um, so yeah, so Nell's gym and maybe a movie, Ulta. That little guy back there has been needing all kinds of attention lately. Hoovy Bones, what's you doing? He hurt himself jumping around outside. And then Chip Chips needed attention. Oh my gosh. He stopped. He was like jumping on her. She's about to get him. She's about to get him. what I use to chart my food right now. And then I have this over here, so I will write it down before I put it away. And I'm just gonna eat this delicious food. It was weird, it's, this is not what I eat every day. I usually eat more vegetables than protein, but my body apparently needs this today because I like couldn't even handle it. Like, couldn't even handle like my cravings for protein. So, that's what happened. And I wanna enjoy this, and I'll see you in a minute. Three hours later. Hey guys, so I am done with the work, and I'm going to get the nails done. It's later than I thought it was going to be doing this, so most everything is gonna happen at night, but, and I also think I might just get a pedicure. I'm not sure yet. For you now, you got two minutes of my time, and I don't really break too easily, but I'm worth it because I'll slip into your dreams tonight. Oh, so give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars. Oh, I'll stick like glue inside your mind. Just watch me break it.
right guys it is time to work out and since this was my first time filming i honestly did a very like i mean it was a really good workout but the filming portion was kind of disorganized but next time it will be better i put this here so y'all can screenshot it if you want to So I went ahead and set everything up that I could um, and then I am, this is not the order that I did all of these exercises, it's close, but um, I did the easy bar with the bar curl and I changed, so for the second set I didn't put this on the sheet, but I changed the, the grip so it's over for the first group and then it's under for the second. And then The goal here is to super exhaust um, my arms so that my back's using, um, my back's doing the work in my core. So I really felt these cable roll rows in my core. So I keep, keep your shoulders back and your shoulder blades as together as possible. And then you pull and you try and stay like, and you can lean forward a little, but it's good to not and to really work that core to keep you stable. So I did three sets of 15 with it over, and then I did three sets of 15 with it under. I'm gonna make sure you don't arch your back when you do this. This is an exercise, and it's not just one exercise, it's many arm exercises um, that I've done in dance classes and different classes like that. And these just, they really like wear your arms out. You don't have to use weights at all for these actually, if you just keep your arms really tight. But if you've been doing it for a while, you can go up on the weight um right those are what i have in my hands are three pound weights so i used to do these when i was a little bit more in shape with 10 pound dumbbells and then these i I'll never use weight for um you're just pushing essentially the air and really contracting those muscles I and mean, you could use weight but i don't The dance instructor that did them called them butterflies and they kill. So then after I did my upper body workout, I did static state cardio. And I did 45 minutes of that. So lots of fun. I got a super good workout in and I definitely am expecting to see some good results on the scale because I have been very consistent with my workouts. If you enjoyed working out with me, comment below and let me know what other types of workouts you'd like to see. Hey guys, so I want to talk to you for a second about Alita. Alita is seriously like one of the best movies I've seen in a long time. Like, I mean, the story wasn't like, the story was awesome. Everything was awesome, but the character, like the technology behind it was amazing to watch. I really loved watching this movie. Uh, yeah, it blew me away for sure. So I highly recommend it. If you haven't seen it, go see Alita, seriously. So I'll put like a little bit of the trailer in just so you can see it like five seconds or something. So go see it and yeah, I will see y'all when I get home.
So it is so late. I know I look like crazy tired, but I've done a lot. I just made some dinner. It's way too late to be eating. It has some cheese, tuna, and broccoli, salt and pepper, all mixed together. I put a tad bit of sour cream, like not a lot, but just a little bit of sour cream in the tuna, which we'll see. <laughs> I know it's a weird dish, but it's like all things that I was kind of craving and the broccoli will keep me satiated no matter what. So this is my my second meal of the day. Typically I only eat two meals and maybe some snacks. Um, but yeah. So yeah, again, Alita is just such a good movie. Also recently I watched, um, what was that movie called? Sorry, Tippy. I just stepped on her. Um, Cold Pursuit. And Cold Pursuit was so good. It was weird though. I don't know, I'm not ready to dive into that yet. And then I also saw Fighting With Your Family or Fighting With My Family. And it's a, actually a true story like based off of a WWE, is that the letter? <laughs> I think it is. Um, wrestler, I don't know. It was super good. It was really funny like, it was a serious movie, but it also had like the entire theater like roaring, which I feel like is pretty rare unless you're seeing like a straight up comedy, which this was not a straight up comedy, but it was hilarious. So, and then when I got home and got this out of the box, I got the straightener. It's the whole reason for my trip to Ulta. It's not the straightener that it was labeled. So the straightener on the top, that had its label was not put in the correct space. So this is the correct straightener that corresponds with that tag, but it's not what I wanted. So I'll be going back to Ulta to exchange that. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed working out with me. I did not enjoy filming it, but I'm, I'm glad, I'm excited to be breaking down barriers, like breaking down the things that hinder me from producing like the type of content that I want to do, um, just any kind of stigma or like worry, like I don't know how to explain it, but every time I do something that really puts me out of my comfort zone, like I feel so much better after. So like anytime I film and I'm just like, you know, I'm respectful of the people around me of course, but I'm like, it doesn't matter what anybody around you thinks. Like if they're looking at you and judging you, like that's their problem. And like anytime I do that and with YouTube, it's forced me to do that. A lot I feel like I grow and that's that's awesome so oh also um yeah so my weigh day is tomorrow so I'll put in the description what I lost this week uh spoiler alert I weighed today and I didn't lose anything so far so unless like which I have some major swelling going on in my ankle let me show you yeah so those ankles I mean so my knee is also very inflamed and swollen and I haven't eaten anything off of my diet. So I don't know what the deal is, but um, I just have some major swelling and heat and pain going on in those areas right now. And I predict that when the swelling goes down that I will have lost anywhere from a half a pound to probably like a little over a pound. Typically when I'm retaining water and swelling like that, that's about how much I'm gaining unless it's like all over like all of like right after a workout my weight will go up like a few pounds so anyway I hope you enjoyed my video as much as I enjoyed making it for you and I would love to have you join me on my weight loss journey I also am going to be posting the dance and clean with me videos regularly and if you would like to see a first impressions review on the straightener that I get, then comment down below and let me know and I will do a review on that and how it works with long hair. The one that I got was specifically for, this is like after the gym hair, sorry. Um, <laughs> um, it's specifically for long hair. So anyway, comment down below, let me know, and definitely go see Alita if that's something that you're interested in, movies and stuff. I love going to movies. Um, if you're not and you'd like to follow along on my journey, go ahead and click the subscribe button and ding the bell. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye guys. <laughs>